Absolutely, I think um, it's exciting now. It's uh, I can tell around the training ground that the, 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 this end of the season now, where every game counts. Um, it's in our hands now in terms of what we do the next two games um, regarding our league position. And uh, you know, this week we've been doing everything possible to, to be right for Saturday night. So it's no change for us. We've, we've been the boys have been fantastic all season. Um, been a great group to work with and. You know, we need to go and put in a really good performance Saturday night. If we do that, like I've always said, if we get the performance right, you know, uh, the wins are not far away. So it's going to be a tough game, all to play for, for them as well as us. So hopefully it makes a really exciting game. And uh, Wilson Nishaw is, is, is giving you a lot in, in uh, what, 70 minutes? He scored two goals in 70 minutes and of course obviously had the equaliser on, on Saturday. Yeah. He's, he's brought a little bit of energy to the team, hasn't he? he? Well, he has. He's brought energy to the team and he's, and he's affected the games. So he scored goals, which is what we want. So, um, you know, the other week when, when you know, I decided to to make changes on the bench and, and you know, I felt that Nishaw could, you know, do well for us at home. I think Harry's coming back to his best now as well. Uh, you know, Prids, you know, young Cheney's done well this week in training. We've got Colton. So, yeah, we, you know, everybody's looking to play. It's been very difficult this week to try and think about the starting 11 and also the subs because it means, you know, some really good players, really good lads not, not being involved even. So, um, it's all good. Nishaw's doing well. He looks very calm in front of goal, which is what's needed in big games. And the games are just going to get bigger and bigger. So, um, yeah, it's he's, he's done well, but um, we've got big competition for places now. Um, obviously, all the all the team have, have welcomed me in really well. Happy to have scored two goals in in my short time here, and hopefully, I can get on the field this Saturday or in the final game against Tulsa in the playoffs and help the team some more, score some more goals. And why here? Why did you decide to come to Sacramento? Um, I, fe I fell in love with it when I came over for a trial. I came over for a week, uh, trained with the lads, went around the city a little bit, welcomed me in, and. Uh, as soon as as soon as we came to contract talks, it was a no-brainer. I mean, I just I, I love the place. Look at the, it's California. I mean, those Englishmen dream of California. And of course, you came in at the same time as as, as Carlton Cole, uh, mm -hmm. a, a big name in in England. Uh, have you kidded him at all about uh, the fact that you've got two goals? He hasn't scored yet for <laughs> for Republic. Definitely. Um, I mean, I've had a little bit more time than him on the pitch, but that's uh, it's. It's no 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 mistake. I've scored the goals. He hasn't. So I, I definitely joke around with him in the change room after training. Yeah. And of course, you uh, earlier this year uh, in England, you scored five goals in a match. Uh, not too many players get get a get an opportunity like mm -hmm. that. So what was that experience like? It was it was uh, it was surreal. I mean, it was it was one for the, one for the memory box. Uh, I mean, everything I touched just went in the net. I mean, I had four one-on-ones, scored them all, and yeah, it was it was just it was pure elation afterwards. It was unbelievable. And what's your thoughts on on the city of Sacramento and playing at Bonnie Field, playing in front of a, a, a pretty rocket battalion? Crowd. <laughs> the battalion. No, it's awesome. I mean, it's it's definitely one of the best atmospheres I've had in my career. Um, the battalion sing all game, which I don't know how they do. I mean, I can't, I can't sing for 90 minutes, but uh, yeah, it's it's unbelievable with the support we have and the fans. So thank you all for coming down and watching us every weekend. It's it's awesome.